Well, what can I say? Public domain strikes again. Hey, what's up guys? This is Josh from Nightmare on Woodsboro Lake. Um, I'm just doing this video really quick on my break. Um, it looks like we are getting another film based on a Disney character. One that is beloved to many, <laughs> I'm sure. Um, and... Uh, yeah, I'm not sure quite how I feel about it. You know, this last year we got Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey. Um, you know, the, the year prior, um, I believe, yeah, we got the Grinch and the mean one. Um, and now uh, we have Mickey's Mousetrap. Um, as well as I've heard that there is going to be a Steamboat Willie movie coming out as well um, and this movie it looks like it takes place in a arcade where have we seen that before <laughs> recently we've seen that quite a bit um, and these kids are being attacked by this killer in a Mickey Mouse head um, there's actually this scene where in the arcade there is a projector, like this room, and it's playing like Steamboat Willie, and it shows on this like poster on the wall, Mickey Mouse and Steamboat Willie. Well, with public domain, I don't know if the oldest Mickey Mouse is now what's public domain, like, like, because the mask kind of reminds me of like the very old Mickey Mouse, like almost to the point I think where it was like the first ones really used in the parks before Mickey got that cute makeover that he got. Um, I know Steamboat Willie, I believe, is what I've heard is public domain. I don't know if they're allowed to use Mickey Mouse yet. Um, you know, in the title, Mouse Trap is one word, so that might be a way that they could play that off legally but the fact that the poster uses mickey mouse i'm not sure i haven't done my research yet because like i said i'm at work i just watched the video on my break um but i mean they might be up for some le like legality battles going on um but it's just the trailer i know it's like when they first come out with these like these are concept trailers but the audio is very rough. The dialogue is very cringe. Um, they even make like a very roughly based uh, reference to Scream and really hacked it up horribly and it just had a lot of grammatical like mistakes. Um, whoever wrote that. Ugh, your English teacher would have a field day. Um, but I just don't know how to feel. If you haven't checked out the trailer yet, go go find it on YouTube. Uh, I'd love to hear what you guys think if you've seen the trailer. Um, sorry, my hand was shaking really bad. It's really cold out here. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you've seen the trailer, uh, if you know a little bit more about the current state of affairs with Mickey Mouse um, and because, you know, with these characters, like the Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey, we got the Winnie the Pooh, like the older Winnie the Pooh, because each one, as they've grown, like, throughout time and they're, you know, re-released and things like that, that's when public domain can, can really loosely take place, is like, well, it was this Winnie the Pooh, not the Winnie the Pooh now, like the original Pooh. 
that they could use. So I'd love to hear if you guys have looked into this yet. I need to go do some research myself, but I'd love to hear your thoughts. Please leave a comment below. I'd love to talk about it. Um, yeah, and if you like my content, whether that's my original content, my movie reviews, my reactions, my skits, um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, it would mean the world to me if you joined the Nightmare on Woodsboro Lake family. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your day to watch this video and uh, hear me out on this new Mickey Mouse Trap film. I'm sure I'll have more uh, to come on that matter um, once I've found out a little more information. Uh, like I said, I've just found the trailer and that's about it. So got some work to do guys all right thank you guys so much and uh keep killing it out there my friends just remember don't get caught don't let the ghosts and the ghouls disturb you